lives be glorified in our hearts in this place today, O oh Lord. As we have gathered here to worship you, Lord, just to love on you, Jesus, for who you are in our lives, O oh Father. We give you glory, we give you all the honor, O oh Lord. As we surrender today in your holy presence, my Father, be glorified in all your ways, Jesus. You alone are worthy, Jesus. You alone are worthy. Somebody open your mouth and tell him how beautiful he is, how good he has been in your life. Tell Jesus something today. This morning, tell Jesus something today. We give you honor, we give you glory, Jesus. Thank you, O oh Lord. Wherever you are, just lift up your hands and sing with me this song today. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I surrender all. Holding nothing, holding nothing, holding nothing. 
give myself, give myself to you. Life is not my own, to you I belong. I give myself, I give myself to you. Life is not my own. My life is not my own. To you, to you. Because you are God. Oh, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Thank you, King of Glory. Thank you, Jehovah. I surrender, Lord. Karibu sana. It's a beautiful Sunday morning and this is the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Karibu sana. Uh, we've started, you know, in just a, a beautiful worship mood and we thank God for a Sunday like this that you're alive and you've given us an opportunity to step into, you know, your living room wherever you are so that we can get to have fellowship together and uh, Karibu sana. This is Sunday best. We are uh, coming to you from the Standard Group Center. And uh, of course, we have uh, an amazing uh, band here. 
Ile jina ina le <laughs> Levine influence Levine influence Levine yes. yes. from um yes kwa Kiswahili inaitwa chachu 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 so we have the Levine influence as a band we have today so appreciate you jipigieni makofi tu tafadhali ah ya 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 makofi yenu iko na njaa jipigieni makofi beta <laughs> Najua tungekuwa na drum, tungekuwa na drum rolls and all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Karibuni sana, it's good to have you. You know what? Today we are talking about um, legacy. And uh, we've had a week and um, a week of just reflecting especially after the passing on of uh, the th third president of the nation of Kenya. That's uh, his excellency the late president Mwai Kibaki. And you know, a lot of things were said. What legacy did he leave? Was he a good president? Was he a good leader? And many things have been said. Many good things have been said. He had his own flaws. But even in that, a lot of good things were said. And I just want to read the, a scripture, the book of Proverbs chapter 13, verse 22. This is just one of the elements of our legacy. The Bible says, A good man leaves an inheritance to his children's children, but the sinner's wealth is laid up for the rushes. It's just one of the elements. And so we get to discuss, we get deeper into it. We'll be pulling in a few people to come and share with us. We'll be having uh, Dr. Abraham Rugo to share on this. We'll also be having um, uh, Apostle uh, Joseph Omondi coming to share and pray together with us. And of course, each and every Sunday, we bring you, uh, you know, those uh, legend musicians. Today we'll be having Mary Wamboi. Siju kama muna kumbuka? Yes. song inaitua? Ile inajulikana sana. Munaijua, munaijua. <laughs> so we'll be having Mary Omboy coming to join us and we'll ahadi abuana haivunjiki milele. So she'll be here and it, it will be definitely a blessing. So let's pray. Father, we thank you for this morning. We thank you for an opportunity like this to fellowship together and to have a good time in your presence on a Sunday like this. For those who did not make it to go to church, we pray that they'll be able to tap something. For those who are going later, for those who went earlier, we pray that it shall be a blessing to them. May you speak to us through your word. May you speak to us through the music. May you speak to us through the conversations. And Father, we pray that you will speak to us through each and every person who will be here. We thank you. We honor you. We pray that today will be an amazing one as you speak to us through this program. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen and amen. amen. Kwa karibuni sana. It's good to have you guys. Sana. I have uh, my brother here, Bosco. Yes, sir. Bosco Baya, kaka ujambo. Sijambo. Wajo umetokea kule Kilifi. Uh -huh. Kilifi County, <laughs> sio? Mwenehu. Mwenehu. Mm, Ebu wa salimie tu kwa, <laughs> kwa lugha ya mama vana. Haya mkacherewa zeko. Eh. Kamuna utu wa sena. Mm. Zala mkaze. Eh, Buwana eh. ukaso. Eh. Izo zote sio? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Karibu sana my brother. Sante sana. So Live and Influence is the name of the band. Yes. Tell us a bit more about uh, Live and Influence. Okay. Live and Influence is a, is a ministerial <laughs> band. All right. We move uh, from places to places just to minister to people, bless mm. them, you know, pray with them, help them where we can. Mm -hmm. uh, not only in prayer, but even in fi finances, if, 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 we are, if God enables us to do so. That's right. Yeah, so basically we are just ministers mm -hmm. of the gospel right. through music. Lovely. Yes. Ministers of the gospel through. And I love the way, you know, you do all kinds of music. You do hip hop. Yeah, sure. <laughs> you do worship music. Leo mtatupigia hip hop moja. Angalau, sinyo? Sawa, sawa. Atutaona kama itaweze kana. All right, but karibu sana. Thank so, you So the band, us. of course, there are more than this. Yes, we are We are about 15 people. About 15? Yes. All right. Mm. And these are, uh, you come from different denominations. Different denominations, different churches. All right. Yeah. All right. Mizizi ni puani. Uh, mizizi ni puani. There's an amazing lady here. I yes. don't know if you've ever seen her beyond the music. This lady. Yes. Yes. <laughs> She's flesh of my flesh. Ah, we ndio ribi yako, sio? Yes. Yes, Becky. Wake up to microphone. Karibu sana, you well? Uko poa. Okay, uko na confidence? Kabisa. <laughs> this is your husband. Is he is he a good man? Uh, very good man. Ah, <laughs> ni mpoa eh? Uh, All yeah, right. Married daddy yako. Yeah. Uh, married daddy yako. Ah, jamani. Uh -huh. Kama bilo umepamba Christmas. Yes. Zile meta meta. 
Ah, meta meta kabisa. <laughs> All right, karibu sana. You do you're you you're one of the lead vocalists yes. in this band. How uh, how has it been for you and what does music gospel music mean to you? <coughs> uh, to me gospel music more so worship. Yes. It's the place where I like I always say on my knees is where I make myself my my my, my faith concrete in Christ. Mm. Yes. So wow, I love to I worship. Like yeah. Apart from praising, I love to worship. Mm -hmm. Yes, that is where I find my confidence in Christ. Right. Yes. Becky, you have a very powerful testimony together with this man. Yes. There was one time for a whole year, mm. you had gotten a baby. Yes. You are you are alone. Yes. You had pneumonia. Yes. Tell us just a bit about that 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 testimony as as we continue. Okay, I was young at age, and that was the time where. I had started falling in love mm. after high school. I was 20 years, so I fell in love with somebody who we bore a child together, but he did not accept me. Mm. So after a while, I was hustling. I I got TB. Oh. So because the doctors were not getting it right, they were treating other things. Mm -hmm. So for six months, I was being tr treated for chest infection. Others were saying it's pneumonia. But it reached a time I was at work and somebody told me, go to Makadara. When I went there, they found out it was TB and it oh. had eaten my left side. Of the lungs. Yes. Wow. So I was down. Okay, the news, when the news was broken to me, it, it, it brought me down. Right. So I went home. When I broke the news to somebody I was staying with, she told me she couldn't stay with me. She so left? I, yeah, no, she, she told me to look for another house. Wow. So I rented a small house, a single room with my son. He was around one year. Mm -hmm. So I became very ill and I couldn't even walk. I used to crawl. Like, it was so bad, mm -hmm. I, couldn't, I couldn't support myself on my, on my feet. And you had no support system? No one. No one came to see me. I only had, there was only one person who I was with. He was called Lynch Atong. Right. So we were with him in college. And what happened, when I used to be to go to college, I would carry for him mandazis and donuts yes. because he didn't have anything to eat. Wow. So when I was sick, it was as if it was payback time. Right. So he was the one who would bring me water, food. He would go and take my salary from the place where I was working and mm. do some small shopping. Right. But then when he would come in the evening, he would find, like, I couldn't even go to the washroom. So, mm. like, kila kitu na malizia hapo kwa room. And the na mtoto sasa. Yes. Wow. And now my son is a worshipper. Mm. At that tender age, he learned how to sing before he talked. Wow. Yes. And I remember we used to sing in the in the house. I was weak because like I couldn't even sleep, I couldn't sit, I couldn't walk. Mm. So like nile ni najaribu side moja ikishindikana ninaenda side nyingine. Wow. So in the midst of it all Nika, he, he came to me, he found, one day he found me singing and he told me, your, your, your healing is in your singing. Mm -hmm. And he took me to their church, ACK. Right. There were a lot of struggles when I went there. Being a single mom, mm. some elders find it hard for a single mom with, you know, yeah. they don't want you to minister. But then I struggled on until I released my album. Yeah. And when I released my album, a week after, somebody brought him to my house. Uh, yes. I had never seen him. I didn't know anyone called Bosco Bayer. Uh -huh. So he came to my house. We were practicing from for a crusade. But I couldn't sing. Yeah. Yeah. too. Like I saw him and something was like in Anisumbua. Like, ah, Yeah, So Nika relax. We didn't talk. We didn't exchange numbers. But the next day in the morning, I did it after Facebook. Mm. He sent me a friend request, mm. and mm. I told him I'm not so active. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm not so active on Facebook. Get my number. Yes. So he took my number, and around seven he called me, and he told me I've been looking for a wife, and that is you. Yani alikuambetu ana tafuta wife. Yes, second day. I okay. want to marry you. <laughs> you know, th this is a very interesting story. Sasa we uli ona demu kona tu wife ukam taka kumaliza. That's another story for another for day. Another day. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I mean, it's a very powerful testimony between the two of them. Yeah. And we thank God that through that moment, you were able to, to, to develop such a deep relationship yes. with Christ. Yes. And here you are. You, you sing and you serve 
like the world is coming to an end. That's all you know. <laughs> wow. Let's appreciate her. Thank you very much. It's good to have you. Kuna pia binti hapa ujambo. Umetoka Taita? Uh, I mean, umetoka Tana River. Umetoka Tana River? Mm -hmm. Ah, wala mamba, sio? Karibu wa ito nani? I mean, ito wa Malika. Okay. Jina langu le bibilia ni lea. Aha. Now, uh, how is it being with this team? Hey, it's been amazing with it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, we've been together in Mombasa. Uh -huh. Yeah, we were singing together. But when I came here and she knew, it's when Bosco called me. Right. And then they told me, ah, we are having a band and I know you, so I just want you to come join. Uh -huh. And you know, there are people who are, are encouraging, especially um, the journey of Christ. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because every time we meet, we have to share a word, we wow. have to pray, besides singing. So... Our main motive isn't just about singing and right. expressing ourselves, mm -hmm. it's about to worship. Right. So I'm really glad because it helps me grow spiritually. Uh -huh. yeah. Amazing. Thank you very much. Let's appreciate her one more time. All right. We, let me just uh, get to know a bit more. Uh, Unaito nani? I'm Sizel. Sizel? Sizel. Umetoka pia na Mombasa? No. Oh. Mini wa huku. Mini wa huku, eh? <laughs> Nairobi. Yeah. All right. So how did you find out about this band? Uh, mine is an interesting story. All right. <laughs> uh, I knew the band through Becky. Mm -hmm. So I met Becky via Kupitia Facebook. So, mm -hmm. Unona Facebook Yafanya <laughs> Mambo. <laughs> so we became friends. Kisha Ali, ali Paso Kunichoria Mchoro. You are Chora, uh you? -huh. So, yes. Through that, we became friends. Kisha tukanza kuongea, hivo hivo. Then she told me, by the way, I have a band. Na mipia ni muimbaji, na imba. And I see you singing. So why, why don't you come and join us? Right. Yeah, so I went on the first Kesha. Mm -hmm. And it was amazing. I, it was, I remember it was on that same night that uh, I received... The, the Holy Spirit. The feeling of the Holy Spirit. I was Spirit. filled with the Holy Spirit. So I saw, ah, hapa kuna mongo. Because yes. you, you, you could just see the atmosphere. It was different. Mm. Yeah, Refreshing. it was different. Wow. And there was God there. Right. Yeah. And, and so here you from are. There, here you to, are. Yeah, to make what? To praise and Amoja. worship Amoja. we Amoja. share a word and it's been a journey amen yeah i'll speak to the other two gentlemen when we come back all right so we will be having the band i mean they'll be here the entire time they'll be a blessing to us as we continue you know celebrating god's goodness praising and worshiping together mm. so we take a short break we'll be coming back later on with uh, dr abraham uh, rugo a very good friend we are talking about legacy mm. and the big question is after all has been said and done and you're gone, what legacy are you living in this world? So don't go too far. This is Sunday Best right here on KT and Home. Let me see that. Oh, man.